people on Zoom. So we're going to start with some in-person questions and then give them a little bit of time to ask a couple questions as well. Um, Coach, once Tamari came into the game, how were you able to adjust your strategy to combat her size in the interior? Yeah, you know, she's so big and strong and she's tough to deal with around the basket. Um, but I thought her post players fought to, to try to get her off the block. Um, we also wanted to crowd her a little bit and then also just make the game as fast as we could um, just to make her run and, and have to move around out there. And I also thought Rebecca did a good job of kind of attacking off the dribble on the offensive end. Coach, outside of Tennessee sort of closing a bit in the second quarter, that was, Ohio State pretty much was in control of this game. Just expand on that a little bit about did you expect more resistance or just expand on your thoughts there? Yeah, I, I mean, I think from from our side of things, we played really hard, and I thought our competitive character for 40 minutes was really good. We competed at a high level. Um, I, I thought we had stretches where we got a little sloppy, uh, but I, I th there was a couple keys coming into it. One, we had to win the war, in the, the battle on the boards, and we did that. Um, and against their size and athleticism around the basket, that's not easy to do. And then the other thing, we had to have our press be effective, and I think we had 28 points off of turnover. So I thought those were the two keys, and um, you know, I, I thought that's where we could, could kind of hurt them if we could keep them off the boards and the press be effective. The game would go our way. Coach, this is your guys' first spring matchup since that first night of the season. Just how important was this game for you guys, and how happy were you with the improvement um, in tonight's showing? Yeah, no, I, you know, I, I don't think we put our best foot forward in that first game against USC, and we didn't deserve to win that day. They deserved to win, um, but we've gotten better. And I told the team after the game that this is the best week of practice that we've had, and that's why we've improved, and that's why we played well today. Go in the back now. Congrats on 1,000 points. Uh, your defense is pretty good today, uh, especially in the paint area interior. Uh, how big of that was a help to your team, and uh, did you really, did you notice how big um, the help was your interior defense? Um, first of all, thank you. But um, uh, I think I just tried to focus on defense during practices, like Coach said. Like we had really good week of practices, so that helped. And also, guards are really helping. Um, so that's a great help from them when I'm guarding the post. Yeah. Coach, from this Tennessee team last year, this year, what were some of the big differences you see from last year's group that y'all played in Ohio State this year? Well, you know, they graduated a great player, Jordan Horston, and she was kind of did a little bit of everything for them. And then, and then right now, I think also they're they're struggling a little bit about, without Rakia. And so for their sake, hopefully she can get back soon. She's one of the best players in college basketball, so that's going to be a big improvement and a, a kind of, a, a, I think, a big jolt, especially to the offensive end, when she can get back. Coach, there's not much to this question. Your thoughts on the officiating tonight? Uh, I mean, I, I, listen, I always look at it like this. Did the officials um, impact who won or lost? And that wasn't the case at all, so I have no problem Can we start off with a couple of Zoom questions, please? Thomas, if you want to get started with us, and then Brianna next. Sure. Um, thanks for the time, Coach. I appreciate it. Happy birthday. Uh, today you had 17 offensive rebounds. So I think that's the most in almost four years. Was this the energy you're hoping to see you mean, going forward from the Buckeyes? Yeah, I mean, in, in general, uh, I knew rebounding would be a huge key to this game. But we did emphasize offensive rebounding all week because you know, what happens is they're so big around the basket. When you drive it, their post players do a good job. They come over and contest shots and try to take them away, which allows the person that they're guarding to come in offensive rebounds. So I thought our guards did a good job attacking and making their post help, and we were able to rebound behind them when we missed. Can you talk about the half-court defense also, how uh, there wasn't one player who really um, hurt you on Tennessee, and you're able to keep everybody relatively um, ineffective. Can you talk about the success of the half-court defense today? Yeah, I mean, I think our half-court defense is getting better. we got a long way to go, but that's just based on the makeup of our team. We should be a really good half-court defensive team. Um, we've made improvements, 
but we're going to have to continue to, to really emphasize that in practice to get where I think we can go with it. Brianna, did you want to add anything? Yeah, sorry, I wasn't sure if he was still going around. Okay. But uh, Celeste, I want to ask you, um, how, how did you look at how you guys did on the press today compared to how you did against USC? And did you see the improvements? Are you starting to feel comfortable in it? Yeah, I think every game is different. Um, so whatever they give us on offense, we just adjust um, in our press um, defensively. Um, but obviously, continuing to build off of that in practice um, and continue to get better. It's obviously going to look better um, on the court when we're flying around. And, you know, Coach always says, like, the effort is going to trump a lot of mistakes. So as long as we're flying around and um, just helping one another out, it'll look good. Uh, last thing I want to ask you guys talked a lot in the preseason about building chemistry because there's not a lot of new pieces. How does a win like today help build that chemistry and give you guys confidence? Yeah, I thought that. <clears throat> yeah, I, I thought that we looked really connected out there today. I think both ends of the court, we we did a really good job playing together. Um, we shared the ball on offense and really kind of moved them around and made the extra pass. And I thought it led to a lot of open shots. That's all for me. Thank you. Any other injuries or questions? Okay. Thanks, everybody. Thanks, everybody.